For those of you that either have never worked with watercolor or gouache before, or you're a, a mixed media artist, or even if you're just a watercolor artist, want a great value on watercolor and gouache paints, the Marie's line is a value that you're not going to see anywhere else. Um, the sets are extremely inexpensive, and they're very nice paints. And I'm just going to show you uh, very quickly um, a couple of the well, uh, a couple of the colors from each set. I'm going to start just with the Marie's student grade set here. Um, I believe it's 12, 12 colors and just kind of show you for a student grade paint what you can what you can expect here still get that nice transparency colors sit up really nicely on top of paper got some um, prussian blue here look at that I mean, beautiful, beautiful, vibrant color. And I'm going to get a little bit of that green from going into the yellow. You can see that. Then finally, um, there's a, a rose that, I, that I've brought out here of their student grade. This is their student grade. So even for a student grade paint, you're going to get great blending properties. So then I will show you the I will show you the artist grade. This is the extra fine Marie's. I'm gonna do a little bit more of a, a color wheel. With uh, the artist grade, you have a, a couple more colors, which gives you a little bit more selection of a palette. 18 colors instead of 12 with the student. And this is a cerulean blue. I'm trying to see what kind of green we're gonna get. And then finally, we will get to our rows. Able to mix a pretty nice violet there, a little purple. The more blue I get in, the more violet will be. Well, let's see what kind of orange we get. Very nice. So then lastly, there is the Marie's gouache. And gouache is an opaque watercolor. So the purpose of the gouache is to, there's a lot of different uses for gouache. You can use it as sign paint. You can use it uh, in fine art. Um, the, the, the key characteristic difference is, is that it's opaque instead of transparent. It still works just like a watercolor in the fact that it, it, it re-wets once it's dry um, and you, you thin it with water, but it, it's designed to be opaque and dry to a, a more matte finish. So let me just show you their gouache very quickly. And go into that cerulean blue. You can kind of see, and I have a, a little color chart of these made up for you. Kind of green you can get. With with gouache, the water. I mean, even with watercolor, you know, it's it's all about kind of water control. But with gouache, in particularly, um, it's even even more so because if you don't add enough water, the, um, the paints don't get that nice 
smooth uh, gradient that you might want um, from a from like a no brush mark finish. If you add too much water, they become transparent. So it's uh, it's part of the game is finding the right balance between the two. But for today, it's just about showing you how they work. And that will also vary depending on the, you know, how much water you add will depend on the, the paint itself, the pigment in the paint. Um, some colors more naturally transparent than others. So let's go ahead and see what kind of oh, really nice violet from, from these two. Hopefully you can see that at home. And then let's see what kind of orange we get. I'm getting a little bit too much of a watercolor effect, too much water in there. I want give to it, give it a fair, a fair go. I'm picking up some of that yellow now, and you can see it going from that kind of more magenta to more of a, a deep orange. And one last thing I will show you is the gouache. Uh, once it's dry, you can see it dries more um, matte. It's also more opaque. You can kind of see here the, the whites are designed to be a very opaque. Um, the red pigments can sometimes have a little bit more transparency, but those blues, the blacks, the uh, greens, very opaque. They dry to that matte finish. So these are Marie's watercolor and gouache sets. Uh, whether you're a fine artist, a mixed media artist, or you want to give something new a try, a great option, very inexpensive, and uh, let you play with some paint. Hope you enjoy.